Hello, hello everybody. It's me, Tina, from Homeschooling and Oils, and today I'm going to show you the inside contents of teaching textbooks. I know a lot of times you see videos um, talk about it, but I usually give a little different little spin on my opinion on certain curriculum, especially after I already tried it. Now, these are two different versions of um, the teaching textbooks curriculum. As you notice, this one has a 2.0 here and this one doesn't. So this means that it was with their first um, process, which means you'll get this a whole lot cheaper. This one is not automatic grading. This one is, and now teaching textbooks have now have put, they call it, I think 4.0. Basically they put everything online. You can pay like a $50 membership and you can like go online and do everything. You don't have to even buy consumable, consumable, sorry about that, books anymore. But I just want to show you the inside of it because you're going to see price variations between both of these. So you will notice that this version is way, way cheaper when ones are reselling it or you find it for sale. Whereas this one is still a little bit more because it has the automatic grading feature. So I want to just let you see how you can actually buy this. Like some people, they just want to just get the book and the workbook. I mean, the workbook and the answer key. Some people just get the workbook, which is this. And some people just use the this. It's all up to you. But when you buy a complete set, it will look like this. You will get, when you buy it in the hard copy, you will get an uh, answer key. Of course, this will say algebra, but I misplaced the answer key. It will say algebra. And this is the disk, the disk that you actually get with the system. So most of you out there, you might be looking for a system that you can do where your children can kind of work standalone because the program actually teach your children how to do math and kind of rework it, redo it. You can actually have them retake the test. That's up to you. Now we have tried this and I do still use it for worksheet purposes sometimes, but for the most part, after a while, my kids got a little, they didn't really care for it too much. Once we, once we started getting up to higher grades, it was actually fun for them when they was in a lower grades, but now they, they really don't like it that much. However, some parents, some homeschools actually love this. So do you have to buy the complete system in order to get the full benefit from the program? In my personal opinion, no, you do not. But with some people, they will say, yes, you do. It just depends on what type of homeschool you, you are. Some people, some homeschool and some people, they're perfectly okay with having just a workbook and an answer key or just a workbook and their students flourishes. Some students and homeschools need everything. They need visual, they need the workbook, and they also need the answer key. It's all up to you, but based on how you purchase it will determine how much you actually going to pay for the curriculum. Now, I'm going to tell you my personal opinion on things that I like about teaching textbooks, things that I don't like about teaching textbooks. Now, with the disc, I absolutely love the, the, the fact that if you use the 2.0, they automatically grade all the work so you don't have to, if you have to turn in grades with your particular state where you're living at, this is a lifesaver because you do not have to do all the grading on the paperwork. It, you can actually print it off, add it to your documents, easy peasy. That's one thing that I do like about it. Also, you can actually work online and offline with these discs that give you the option. Another thing is that these teaching textbooks is an investment in my personal opinion because if you buy this, because it's like once you get to the higher grades, it's more pricey. Once you buy this and you keep it in good condition, you can resell it and it still has a high turnover resale value. So say for example, you spend $150 on this. You can actually get a hundred, sell it for a hundred dollars and individuals are looking for it for a hundred dollars or 85 or $95. So I have a high turnover rate. So if you're looking for curriculum to use and to buy, to, that's also going to be an investment that can also turn over and put money back into your homeschool or back into your business, this will be very, very good for you because that's one thing that I absolutely love about teaching textbooks. The turnover value is amazing when you have this auto, this 2.0. The turnover value for the 1.0 is not that great because it does not have the automatic grading feature. And many people want that automatic less work that they have to do. Although you don't have this automatic 
grading feature, you still can get um, maybe $25, $35, $45, depending on how complete your set is. So if you're just selling uh, this and this, you probably get $25, $35. Bucks. But if you're selling this, you can go anywhere from $85 to $100 bucks with reselling it at used value in a real good condition. That's one of the perks of teaching textbooks 2.0. That's what I absolutely love about it. So if you were kind of skeptical about should I buy, shouldn't I buy? Well, you can go ahead and buy it. If you don't like it, it's not really a big deal because the turnover rate, you can get your money back. Now, what I don't like about teaching textbook, look how thick this book is. Now, this is supposed to be for one year, right? Most children are not going to get through this entire book in one year. And people be trying to tell you, oh, yes, they will. Not unless they work at it nonstop all the time. This book is almost 800 pages long. It's possible, but if you have a child that, if you have a child that absolutely love math, they will have no problem, no issue with getting through it, through all of this in one year. But if you have a child that has um, anxiety in regards to math, it's going to be a problem because it's just way too thick. So if you have a child that's apprehensive about math and you give them this thick book, ooh, it's not going to be a good situation. The other thing that I don't, in my personal opinion, nothing I do not like about teaching textbook, once it start getting up to the highest, um, gr the higher grades, the print, the font is way too small in my personal opinion, just too small. And I think they do it so that the book won't be, it won't be larger than what it already is. Um, you have a whole lot of problems for each little section. And one thing I do not like about teaching textbook, let me show you the answer key. Even though you do get an answer key when you buy the complete set, but as you can see, it's just the answers. So say, for example, you're trying to teach this and you're not that great at pre-algebra or algebra one. You've been out of school for a while like me, right? And math was not your thing, but I absolutely love math now. So homeschooling helped me love math. So I absolutely love it. math now. I'm actually a math tutor. Can't believe I love math. Absolutely love it. The thing that I don't like about this is only, it only has the answer. So say, for example, your child is having difficulty. They have part of the problem right and the other part wrong. And you know how to do the problem yourself, but you are having a hard time as a teacher or the parent to explain it to your child in a way that they can benefit from it. You're explaining, but they just don't get it the way that you're explaining to them, right? There's there's not anything that you can go back by and see step by step to actually hone in and show your child where they went wrong at. That's why I don't like it. That's why I love learn um learn math fast because they show the equations step by step worked out in the back of the book. Um another thing, this is pre-algebra. You can, in my opinion, do this with... Now, this one is is better because you see how the font is more bigger. I like this a whole lot more. But again, my daughter, she started with her pre-algebra. And I had to end up switching to um, a less overwhelming pre-algebra book for her. Because this was just way too much. See how thick it is. So that's my personal opinion. If you want an automatic system and you do not want to teach math, I encourage you to get the... As we one 2.0 versions only or higher, 2.0 or higher, because it'll have that automatic grading feature. Now, you still can buy 1.0. This is the one that's 1.0, but you got to keep in mind that it will not be automatic grading. Another thing that parents also say about teaching textbook is your, ch your children can go back and kind of redo the system, so to speak. So if they miss some answers and stuff like that, they can go back and kind of maneuver in such a way that they have the answers right and you don't really and you think they understand it and they really don't understand it so you really have to keep your eyes on it real real good when they're using the teaching textbook because sometimes they can actually go in and kind of maneuver you know i love brainiac children they can go in and kind of maneuver and you thinking they really understand it but they just memorize the answer from the previous question and just put it on the next question but overall, if you're looking for something that is automatic, you probably would like it. If you're looking for something that is more of an investment that you can purchase one time and then resell it to get some of your money back, 2.0 is a good buy. And that's all I have to say about this. But I did want you... Ooh, let me just show you some inside of the book a little bit. That's what I meant to do. This is the last thing. Show you how some of it looks. This is the pre-algebra one. 
I do like how sometimes they have picture illustrations because you know we are heavy visual learners here. So I'm trying to let you see how the format kind of looks so it can best so it can help you. A lot of parents who do use teaching textbook, they like the workbook feature because they can actually homeschool on the go and your child can take this workbook with them. A lot of them that are not using internet. So some people actually like it for that reason as well. Let me show you how the inside of the algebra book looks. See how extremely small this print is and for this. Woo, I, I just I just do not like small print. I I, I need something a little bit bigger. <laughs> But anyway, just want to let you get a little peek inside of um, the teaching textbook, just in case you were thinking about buying teaching textbook and you was kind of like, ah. you see certain videos, but I'm just going to give you my honest, transparent review of my personal opinion. Now, some people absolutely love this, but it just was not a good fit for me and my homeschool. After we start getting up, progressing to pre-algebra, algebra, algebra I'm, this, this was not a good choice. My, now, my children absolutely love teaching textbooks for third, fourth, fifth, and sixth grade. When it got to seventh grade, yeah, it was kind of shaky. And then it goes from seventh grade to pre-algebra, algebra one. And then it just went downhill for us with teaching textbooks from that point on. But younger kids, my kids, when they were younger, they absolutely loved three, four, three through six. So this is a good option. My kids did very well with it. Um, in the beginning, they just don't care for it. Now we use uh, Learn Math Fast. And I also use other resources and DVDs to um, accommodate the visual aspect that we need as well. So I hope that you enjoyed this review. If you have not yet, hit that like button. Please hit the like button. And also, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I am on my way to a thousand subscribers. We are moving up, moving on. And we got going all the way up to my megawatt 1000 sub subscriber giveaway i'm so excited so a lot of this stuff that i'm reviewing maybe we use some some of it we didn't it may be in the giveaway with a little bit of extra stuff i'm not gonna tell you exactly what it's all gonna be but it's gonna be amazing and it's not just one thing it's several different things so i will talk to you guys later have a great rest of your day bye